Hi guys, I've got a tiny little electrical problem to fix here. This is one of these cheap power banks from Pound Land or Pound World. And this is my cheap charger doctor, which you might notice is flickering a bit. And I'm pretty sure all it is is the solder joints where the USB connector goes onto the main board has come loose. So I've got to see if I can get this apart and resolder it. Shouldn't take more than a few minutes if we can get it apart. It looks like little plastic clips in there. It's a matter of whether it's got glue in there as well. It's one of my favourite tools. It's actually a letter opener. It's not going to get into the gap. Oh, that's some movement then. There we go. See, there's little pegs with holes in them. And light catching that. Let's try that the other way around. A little bit sticking up there that those holes latch into. So that's that. I'm hoping it's just. Yeah, I can see it moving. Um, can we zoom in? I don't know if we can see it, but I'm pretty sure it's that one just there. All I've got to do is put hot soldering iron on there and that'll fix it. I'm looking at that chip and there's some very tiny writing on it. So I'll see if I can zoom in on that in editing to see what it actually says. Couldn't zoom any more because I'll lose the focus. Yeah. So we'll just have to rely on editing. Job done. Soldered there and there. I did both sides while I had the soldering iron out. Let's try one of these. Okay. Wobble it around. Yeah, that one's fine. Just out of interest, this is another one. Five oh one, five oh two. Five oh four. So this one's giving us a slightly higher voltage than that one. I don't think I'm particularly worried about the hundredth scale. Yeah, looks okay. So can we get the cover back on? That shouldn't be a problem, should it? The only thing is, chances are these have broken a bit so it won't hold together quite so well.
that the right way round? No, upside down. Yeah, we want the writing on that side, don't we? There we are, back together. Job done.